The great party featuring 12 nations and the turnout reflects the significance. The atmosphere, a real treat for those who are part of it. It is indeed special. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. The strains of the national anthem of Brazil. Day one, and everybody eager to get off to a good start. Yes, and that's very apparent, Peter. Competition football is a different beast entirely, and you have to be prepared to dig deep to prevent everything going south very quickly. So this could be a, a tentative standoff in weighing each other up. I hope we'll see more probing than possession. So that's got things on the way. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Marquinhos. He's one of the toughest and most competitive centre-backs in the business. He's the kind of player you can rely on to always be just where you need him, making a vital interception or just making life difficult for the opposition to get through. And that's a, a very valuable characteristic. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. And they're not going to make any further progress now. And here's Campbell. Gets away from his opponents. And the finish! A great save, real class. Campbell simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Played into space out wide. Massive leap! Good delivery, no joy. Vinicius Junior really showed that he wanted it more than anyone else, but maybe heading requires extra practice. Costa Rica have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. It's Casemiro. Battles to win it back. Dashing forward at pace. Let's put a stop to that. Danilo. It's a decent looking cross. Still goalless. Lucas Paqueta. Well positioned to make that interception. Lucas Paqueta. Danilo. Casemiro. It's gone out for a throw in. Vinicius Junior has it in a wide position, so what next? Uh, let 
down by a lack of accuracy. Has a hit! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. And it's Campbell. That is terrific skill. Campbell. Oh, sweet feet. There are a few waiting for it. Look at the goal! Danger averted for now. He gets past his man. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Uh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Lucas Paqueta. Not long till half-time, and it is still goalless. Oh, nice touch. Lucas Paqueta. Forward it goes. Looking for a decent ball in. Chooses to go back. Plays it out to the wing. Nicely controlled. Looking to go deep. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have spoiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Hey, views on the first half. Brazil have been playing relatively well from what I've witnessed. Good movement and the ball retention has been quite strong and it's led to a few chances. It's just that cutting edge that's lacking at the moment and it's fixable. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. And the game has already resumed here. Nil-nil then, and we're back on the way. Just brushed off the ball there. He's got options out wide. Now the counter. Oh, that's neat. It's one! Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Towering header! In for the pieces! It's there! The second half sparks straight into life! Keno Navas reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Oh, that's great awareness, full marks to him as he was just that bit quicker than everyone else on the follow-up. Brazil break the deadlock. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worth a treat. Receives it from behind. Lovely bit of skill. Great leap! Lucas Paqueta. Gorgeous control there. And it's Danilo. 
pumps it into the area. Brian Ruiz. Hoists it forward. Done very well to intervene. Vinicius Junior. Shoots! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And it's played forward. Brian Ruiz. Campbell, Brian Ruiz, Casemiro concedes a free kick for that. <laughs> he's gone for the shot. Oh, he's hit the bar. Defending of the desperate variety. Vinicius Junior. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Yeah, the ride is still a bit bumpy, Peter, so they're chasing the cushion of a second goal. Losing in on the last quarter of an hour. Brazil have made a great start to the second half, and it's 1-0. Looking to get within range. Oh, has a hit! Oh, should have been the equaliser. Campbell is looking pretty upset with himself. It should have been a leveller. The changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Casemiro. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? He's got the ball glued to his feet. Up to meet it! Should have equalised. <laughs> this could fall anywhere. The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and... You have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Brazil presented with the perfect chance here to open up their lead. And he's going to Rex. And how good was that? He's got himself a pitch of a goal. With that goal comes comfort. Dispatched expertly, nicely done. So that's two now without reply. Into the last five minutes. Surely this will be the last chance. Lucas Paqueta.
Vinicius Junior! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. And he's there to clear it. Lucas Paqueta. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. That's a hit! Danilo gets... And time is up. Brazil starts as they wanted to start. All three points. The first three points, crucial. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Listen, ideally, Ali Lukan 